D'Onofrio. This is Cricket Halo Galleries, uh, 137 Kinder Kamek Road, Park Ridge, New Jersey. Uh, we are a custom picture framing shop and uh, in February we opened a new addition, um, the Art Gallery. We feature local artists every month and so our genres are varied. We have um, painters, uh, we have still lifes, we have watercolors, we have contemporary art and the beauty of it is that they're all local artists. Um, we feature new artists every month in the uh, inner gallery and in the outer gallery. This month we're showing in the inner gallery Laurent Sisman who is from Park Ridge. She's a, an artist of international uh, renown and her art has recently been featured in a film um, featuring Kate Hudson, Something Borrowed. Um, her work is beautiful. She does landscapes. She's recently started painting on copper. Um, the work is luminescent and really spectacular. We would encourage you to come and see her work. We're also featuring Eli Hilu. Um, his work is also landscapes and paintings. Uh, he has a variety of genres, um, but mostly landscapes. In addition, we're showing Karen Rhodes this month, and uh, she has a beautiful, beautiful style in watercolor. Tonight is an artist reception where the artists come and greet visitors and people who want to see their artwork. We, feed, you know, we offer wine and cheese and it's a chance to mingle and it's a nice night out in the town. Um, kind of low stress, something to do without getting, a, you can get a little culture without going into New York City, which is a lot of fun. We're also featuring different workshops here. Um, Marcy Cooperman, who is local, is going to be doing uh, some um, color theory classes and classes in watercolor. Uh, George Garbeck is on the books to do a Photoshop session, how to use Photoshop and light, and light box. Um, Lorraine Minetto is going to do painting demonstrations. Um, so we have a lot of things coming up that are not just artist receptions. Mostly we do them on Thursday nights. We try to um, advertise them in the local newspapers so you can check there and you can always call the shop to see what's upcoming. Hi, I'm Leon Sisman and I have uh, several of my works here at Crooked Hello as part of a two artist show running through the end of September. Uh, these are a couple of my works and I paint mostly nature. Uh, sometimes it's nature done a little bit metaphorically. I have um, a body of work that consists of flowers that are not really just about flowers. Oftentimes they are two on the canvas and they sort of relate to each other. So it's a whole um, life cycle, life story done with flowers. And I have landscapes and often the landscapes have somewhat unusual composition for a landscape. Uh, they show a body of water seen through a screen of trees and it's because um, to me a lot of that is a metaphor for the journey. Uh, some of the works I have here at this show are actually works that were done on location, um, otherwise known as plein air paintings, like for example uh, these couple of paintings. When it's done on location, uh, for me then it's less about the notion and more about the experience of being outside and really be able to uh, see firsthand the colors and breathe the atmosphere and be able to translate that onto canvas in a way that's going to hold. Uh, these works tend to be somewhat smaller because the light changes real quickly. So I have no more than three hours and three hours is a lot usually for an outdoor session. If I need to um, come back then I will come back another day or I may finish it up in the studio but the whole, um, the whole experience is a lot quicker than, than a studio painting is. From these I started more recently doing some oils on copper and these are my newest works and painting on copper really lets me um, show some of the textures that I like doing on canvas anyway. Copper is a very uh, smooth surface and I can really um, go wild with some of these textures because I can lift paint and um, and create marks that would be a lot harder to create on a canvas. So I have some of my uh, copper paintings um, featured here at this exhibit. This is actually the reception night, so this is the first official opening. Uh, but I know some people have been here ahead of time, and I know Elka uh, Denofrio, the owner at Crooked Hello, has been um, getting some favorable comments, which, which is really nice. 
Hi, my name is Karen Rhodes, and I'm a watercolor painter. I love the media because you can get such transparency and such lights and vibrancy, and I like impressionism. So uh, my paintings are often uh, impressionistic. I like to do landscapes, particularly with some buildings in them. Uh, I like street scenes, like this is one of Hudson, New York. Um, this is a very famous scene. Thomas Cole painted this. It's, it's uh, from Haynes Falls, looking out toward, uh, from Twilight Park over to the Hudson in the spring with the water flowing. And um, this is a spring scene, spring rushing stream. I really like subjects with buildings where you can just set them in the scene and, and see the, uh, the shadows play off the lights and the darks. I love painting outdoors as much as possible, weather permitting, and uh, you can just see things. Once you start doing watercolors, you see light and shadow like you've never seen before. You just observe the scenes so much better. This one is um, North Lake and it's in the fall with lots of reeds and shadows and, and I, I like the effect of the birches, the white birches contrast with all the different color. I learned how to paint, I guess as a kid I always liked to paint on windows and do different crafts projects. Then I pursued other careers and when I had the time I got back to, I did ceramics and then actually my husband signed me up for a woman's watercolor classes and I got in the mail I got her flyer and I started taking classes and I just fell in love with it. My name is Eli Hilu. Eli Hilu, uh, all my life I was painting uh, in different places of the world when I was there. Uh, for example this painting it's Lake Champlain. When I began to paint, I was sitting here, began to rain, I escaped. <laughs> I come back yeah, after one hour to continue to paint. It's a beautiful place, Lake Champlain. Oh, Jerusalem, Jerusalem is a fantastic place. The race religion began here, really. It's a, the Jews synagogue where you were there and the wall in wall there, the Islamic and the Christian here. It's really, they, when you walk there, you feel the, the walking together with the Lord. <laughs> National Park in Utah. Uh, the name, Orange Forest, part of the mountain with the snow. The contrast, orange with the snow and green. It's a beautiful place in Utah. It's America, America landscape. I am from Argentina. I studied many years there from very good uh, teacher maestros. The Red Sea, and I love South, South Israel. <laughs> the Red Mountain, Edom Mountain. Edom is mean red. And sometime in the afternoon you can see the reflection of the red and the, on the sea. Because that the people put the name Red Sea. It's because the mountain. It's a beautiful tourist place. They have it there. 40 hotels like this. Uh, a lot of people from all world go there for vacation. This is safety place, fantastic place, beautiful.